In this tutorial, we will understand what is chunk split in PHP. Chunk split is a function split a string into series of smaller part. Chunk split split a string into smaller chunks. You will completely understand how to use this function when I explain the example of it. So first, let's understand the syntax of this function. The chunk split function starts with a chunk split name. Now keep in mind, you need to specify the exact name when you are using this chunk split function. The first parameter is a required parameter for this function, which is body. The body parameter is a string to be chunk. Then we have the chunk length. This parameter is an optional parameter. Using this parameter, you can specify the chunk length. This parameter used to define the length of the chunks. The default value of this parameter is 76. The third parameter is end. This parameter used to line ending sequence. This parameter is optional. For example, I'm going to just create here str string and specify daily tuition to it. And then I'm going to echo chunk split. And in the parenthesis, I'm going to specify parameter to it. The first parameter is a body. So we need to specify the str string here to this chunk split function. Then we specify the second parameter, the chunk length. I'm going to specify here two, and then I'm going to specify the end parameter. So I'm going to specify here dot. When you echo this statement, it's going to return something like this. It will chunk the string into smaller pieces. So this is your first chunk of string. This is the second chunk and this is the third one and so on. So this will just chunk this string into smaller pieces. And at the end of every chunk, you have your dot. You can change the chunk length as well. If I specify here one, then the result something look like this. Now, what if you have number and you want to convert that number into time format? For example, let's say I have a string one, two, three, four and I want to convert this string in the time format. So I'm going to first add sub str function and in the parenthesis, I'm going to call chunk split. And in this chunk split function, I'm going to specify my body. So I'm going to specify this string, then I'm going to specify the chunk length two, and then I'm going to specify here colon. And then I'm going to pass my second parameter to this sub str. So I'm going to pass here zero, and then I'm going to pass third parameter minus one. Now, when I try to echo this statement, I'm going to have the result something look like this. I'm going to have my time format. Now, I'm using this sub str function to remove this colon from the end of the string. If you just echo this chunk, you're going to get this colon at the end as well, like this. I'm going to just use this str sub to remove this colon. So, I'm going to have my time here. Now, what if you want to specify question mark at the end of the statement? So, for example, let's say I have here a string. Do you like PHP? And I want to add a question mark at the end of the statement. I'm going to just simply echo chunk split function. And in the parenthesis, I'm going to first specify this body. So I'm going to specify here str as a body of the first parameter. Then I'm going to specify the second parameter, which is the chunk length. I'm going to just call str length function and then pass str to it. So this function is going to return the length of this string. And then I'm going to pass a question mark which I want to add at the end of the statement. Now, when I try to execute this echo statement, it's going to return the result something like this. So you will have your question mark at the end of your statement. Using this str length, you don't need to specify the length of your string. It will automatically return the length of your string. So these are the small techniques you can use to split string into chunks. If you like short videos like this, make sure to subscribe and like this video. I will see you in the next one.